Wednesday night in the Union Ballroom, University of Nebraska Lincoln students gathered to belt a tune or two in the fourth annual Husker Idol competition sponsored by the Residence Hall Association. It's actually a long running event. This is the fourth annual time that we've done this. And over the last couple of years, it's kind of died down. But uh, we've decided to revive it because it's a very successful program. Christina Brockman, a freshman psychology major, was one of eight contestants, all vying for the $200 grand prize. Um, well, I've been in chorus since like seventh grade, and I took private singing lessons last year for a little bit, and I did NISMA, which in New York it's like a competition, a singing competition, and Skimmy Out, which is another one, and I've been a bunch of talent shows and stuff. Two of the three judges were RHA members. While not formal musicians, they still knew what to look for in a Husker Idol. I don't have much music background. I, I, play, I played the violin for several years, but I don't have any singing background whatsoever. Uh, so I, it was kind of just a very opinionated sort, sort of thing, like did I like it, did I not like it. You know, I, I probably have a little bit of the Simon in me. Everyone knows Simon, so I can tell you about that. that I put down in words. Scott McHenry, a junior finance major, won the contest, stirring the 30-odd people in the crowd with renditions of Let It Be by the Beatles and Your Song by Elton John. It means a lot because, you know, there was a lot of people there tonight uh, who did a great job and who could have easily won, so, um, you know, it was a really close competition. It might help go pay uh, rent, so <laughs> it's kind of nice to get it now. I don't have to worry about where my next uh, rent check is coming from. RHA is already planning for next year, hoping for more of an audience for the talented contestants in Husker Idol. I'd like to see more, more people in the audience, but we were kind of picking up from uh, a little bit of a, a low in terms of like the, the size and scope of the event from last year. I think this year we brought it back to where it needs to be in terms of the event itself. I think people will remember that next year, and when it comes around, they will uh, come out en masse.